All right, how's it going guys? If you've been following the Kyosho MP10TE, um, this is the wrap up video. Um, I figured I would spare y'all from a really another bad, bad time lapse uh, and just flip the camera around and uh, show you the finished product. So stick around and check it out. But all right guys, enough wasting time. I'm gonna flip the camera around and show you the finished product. Um, I'm really happy with it. I think it turned out pretty good. But alright guys, hope that was a little bit better than the whole, you know, horrible time lapse thing. Uh, but I'll kind of give you a little bit, another little close up and kind of explain the, some of the stuff that I actually bought to go in the car. Um, but it's pretty much simple. Like I said, it's the ti you know, titanium screws, like I said before. I actually got the titanium turnbuckles in here now. Um, high tech servos, of course. Their customer service have always been really, really nice to me. Uh, I haven't, I have the same servo in my Nitro Buggy and Nitro Truggy. But I haven't really got to run it besides just in the parking lot or, you know, out here on the road um, in the driveway to break the motors in. But it's the D945TW. It seems to be really good. Um, like I can't say, we'll see how they hold up. But I'm running the uh, the Tekken uh, motor and speed controller or ESC, I'm pretty sure. Um, like I said it's the RXA, the Gen 3 stuff. I can't really say. <laughs> like I said, it's my first time running it. Uh, I did opt to get the black case and then just switched it over from the white. Because I think, you know, the, they just come with a white case. And I really didn't care for the white. So, But they actually offer the case in black. So I just picked that up. So, and this is the case original. Like I said, I'm really, which, you know, if you hang around, you'll see. I'm like really weird about like I want everything to match. Um, the wires I think is cool because it matches my paint scheme. So, you know, but yeah, I'm, I'm really weird about like how everything goes together and looks. So but I put my laps uh, up on top right there, just kind of screwed it down and made like a little branch to hold it off or like a little standard to hold it. But like I said, that aluminum uh, wing stay brace, it's pretty simple. And I think it's like King's head or something like that. They all, they make like these little ends. I kind of put that to kind of caption the, uh, the turnbuckle but other than that it's pretty pretty straightforward um it's definitely the front suspension feels kind of soft because it's you know it's a lot of weight on here now that it's electric so probably get some stiffer springs but anyway i guess uh, that'll be enough of me rambling i just hope you'll stick around and subscribe because tomorrow or today we're going to go get some actual track time with the nitro car so i'm kind of Looking forward to it, but you know, it's a brand new car, gonna get it dirty and scratched up. But anyway, we'll have some fun. But, all right, I hope you I hope you got, you know, found this interesting. You know, maybe you you like Kyosho and you wanna run Truggy, but you know, you just don't like Nitro, so um, it's possible. Um, I can't wait to get this thing on the track. I think it's gonna be sick. It looks beast, I cannot wait. But that'll be on another video. But okay, guys, I'm going to get out of here. I appreciate you for watching. 
uh, please, it means the world to me. Uh, stick around, subscribe, uh, help the channel grow, like watch me learn, see if I can figure this stuff out. It's something I've always wanted to do, um, the whole YouTube thing. So, um, but I'm not really a tech, a tech kind of guy. So for me, this is all new, like camera equipment and editing and stuff. Like I know it's horrible, but you know, you gotta start somewhere. But I do appreciate every single one of you, and um, I can't wait to get some RC stuff and you know more footage of my RC stuff and get into it because I truly do love this hobby. It has always been there for me, and I cannot wait. So I'm tired of letting them sit on the shelf. It is about some RC stuff. I'm ready. But anyway, that's enough of me talking nonsense. Um, I guess I'll see you at the track here shortly. Dino! Come on, Dino! Come on! Hurry! Hurry, Dino! Come here! <laughs> Hello, what's a good buddy? Just a good buddy. 